right, YouTube, here we go. I got it. It is in the new English box that I ordered from Tokyo a couple days ago. All right, this is uh, my actually my third box, but the second box was Japanese. Uh, so let's get into it. And these are always, yep, all right. You know, I need to get like an X-Acto knife or something. And let's cut this off real quick. Anyway, I was a little worried. Uh, Amazon was in charge of shipping this one and it actually took longer than 48 hours. Last time I ordered, I got like next day, which is nice. Um, so yeah, here's that. And that, all right. Throw this box away. All right, here we go. Uh, let's start with the first one. Yeah, look at that, Beast Token, all right? Pretty nice, uh, I do like the tokens, this is really nice. Pacifism, Enchant Creature. Enchanted Creature can't attack or block uh, old uh, reprint. Let's see, Almighty Bush, Brushwag, uh, Trample, three and a green, gets three plus three, cool. Uh, Day Squad Marshal, when Day Squad Marshal enters the battlefield, create a one, one white human soldier creature token. That's a lot, he's a three, three, I guess, but. Uh, that's a lot of mana for not very much stuff. Uh, keep safe, one in a blue, counter target spell, target player, or targets a permanent you control, draw a card. I actually kind of like that, you know, the one in a blue is actually pretty, uh, pretty well balanced right there, and you get to draw a card, so it's pretty much a counter for one, but anyway. Escape protocol, whenever you cycle a card, you may pay one. When you do, exile a target artifact or creature you control, then return it to the battlefield and it's under control. I'm not a big cycle fan. Bastion of Remembrance. When Bastion of Remembrance enters the battlefield, create a 1 1 white human soldier creature token. Whenever your creature you control dies, each opponent loses one life and you gain one life. Alright, Swamp. That's a really nice Swamp. Alright. Uh, Nascent Metamorph. So, this is our commander card. If you didn't know, there's a, a C20 card in each one of these packs. So, um, this is the one we got. I was actually hoping to get one of those new free spells, you know, the free commander spells, but apparently not, at least not this time, so, anyways, uh, whenever Nascent Metamorph attacks or blocks, target opponent reveals cards from the top of their library until they reveal a creature card, uh, Nascent Metamorph becomes a copy of that card until their turn, then that player puts all cards revealed this way on the bottom of the library, it's actually pretty cool, it's only two, alright, so, I mean, it's a 1-1, one, one, but it's not really a 1-1, one, one, right, so, uh, not bad. So, yeah, let's, uh, oh, oh no! Well, <laughs> that was rough. Uh, Alright, Racist Great Shark. Uh, this is our first full art of the, bo of the box. Uh, enters the battlefield, counter target artifact or creature spell. Uh, foil rare, whenever you cast a non creature spell, draw a card. That's a whirlwind of thought. Uh, Trumpeting Gnar, I like these alternate arts, they're pretty nice. Um, Ash Auspicious, Auspicious Sterix, Elk Beast. Alright, here's our first Triome. These are going up in price pretty well. Uh, pretty nice, pretty nice arts they got on them. Uh, so this is the Mountain Plain Swamp, uh, Savai Triome. Another cool art. So here's our, uh, our Godzilla for the pack. Uh, Durat, the perfect pet. Alright. Also known as a Sprite Dragon. I'll put that there. Migratory Great Horn. All right, and that's our foil, all the art. Pretty nice. All right, um, next pack. All right, all right, cool feather. All right, Brush Meat Poacher. Um, yeah. All right, I know you guys don't really care about these commons, but you know, I'll let them sit on the screen for a second just in case you haven't seen them. No, it's still not available in the States yet. Uh, but almost was it like two weeks, I think. Dire Tactics. Let's see. Close to Recluse Island. Alright, first rare. The commander rare we got was the Verge Rangers. Uh, Human Scout, first strike. You may look at the top card of your library at any time. As long as an opponent controls more lands than you, you may play lands from the top of your library. This is a pretty solid card. I think it's going to see a lot of play. Um, yeah. Put that one up there. Uh, another full art, Death's Oasis. Not a fan. Ooh, Foil Triome. 
Look at that. All right, that's pretty good. Put that there. Uh, that was the Forest Island Mountain. All right, um, let's see. We got the Insatiable hum Hemophage. Sorry. Cloud Piercer. I got like 15 of these. I don't know why the Cloud Piercer is pretty much in like every pack. All right, another Triome. All right, full art Triomes. All right, next one's going to be King Caesar. All right, Ancient Guardian. All right. Ooh, we got the Foil Octopus Full Art. So that's the, the Foil Octopus Full Art. Pretty nice, pretty nice. All right. Next pack. Let's see what we get. All right, that one didn't want to rip open. Let's see it cracking. Crash it. All right, cracking. Uh, Adventures Impulse, Corpse Churn, uh, Hampering Snare, Thwart the Enemy, Migration Path, Pouncing Shore Shark. I do like all the sharks. I'm a big shark fan, but uh, these all look pretty cool. I like the sharks. Uh, Island, it's always good. Foil Island, uh, Vitality Hunter. Lifelink, uh, when it becomes monstrous, put a lifelink counter on each of up to X target creatures. Cool. Ooh, full art ozolith. Nice. Good pull, good pull. Alright, classification. Do not like that card. Uh, another hemophage. Cloud piercer. Ooh, uh, the full art. Gem razor. We'll put that up there. It's pretty nice. And then here's our Godzilla card. We got uh, Angurious. Ang Angurious. Armored Killer. All right. That's all right. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. And then a Foil Cloud Piercer. I told you, it's in like every pack. All right. Foil, maybe. Full Art, maybe. Definitely one, though. All right. All right. All right. So we got a Cat Bird. Ridiculous. <laughs> cat Bird. All right. Uh, unlikely Aid. Honey Mammoth. Man, what is he eating? Oh, lots of honey, obviously. All right. Swiftwater Cliffs. It's a really nice looking art. Uh, Wingfold. Yep. Weaponize the monsters. Sacrifice creature. Weaponize the monster. Does two damage to any target. That's for two. One drop enchantment. I wonder if that's got some play in it. Uh, easy Prey. Planes. All right. Here's our commander card. Martial Impetus. Creatures get one plus one and is goaded. I hate goad. All right. We'll just... Whoops. All right, first full art, Mythos of Snapdax. I love these arts. These arts look really nice, actually, in my opinion. Put that up there. Nice. Full art, Phoenix. I'm going to take that. Here's a Parcel Beast. No Cloud Piercer. Surprise. Boneyard Lurker. Uh, another Triome full art. Nice, nice. And boom! There it is. We got the one. Boom. All right. There it is. Now, I do think these are going down in price a little bit, but uh, I've got a stack of them, so it's kind of nice. Maybe I'll give one away at some point. Pretty crazy. All right. Put that one over there. All right. And then uh, no cloud person in that pack. Surprise, surprise. <clears throat> All right. Sorry. Let's see. Next pack. Cat. So first we had a, was it owl cat? I don't even know where that went. Cat owl, something like that. Cat. All right, cool. Uh, hampering snare. Thwart the enemy again. <laughs> Unexpected fangs. Greater sandworm. Chittering harvester. Hornbash mentor. And the forest. And this should be our first rare, I believe. Yeah. So here's our commander card uh, that we've been talking about. Commander card. All right. Uh, whenever a player casts a spell, if it's not their turn, that player draws a card. I actually really like that. I think that's got some EDH play for sure. All right. I think that'll see a lot of play. Uh, put that up there. All right, Skycat Sovereign, first foil, or first foil, first full art. Shark Typhoon, all right, Sharknado in the house. Here we go. Uh, foil, cool. Uh, here we go. Pull galore, Cavern Whisper. Oh, we got the full art Planeswalker. Alt art, I think they did a really good job on these alt arts, honestly, but they, this is a really good looking card. Um, all right, so put it aside. Oh, I don't have this one yet. This is a new pool. Wow, that's cool. Rodin, Titan of Winged Fury. That is nice. Okay. Uh, so that's our full art. Full art foil. Mythic. Nice. Alright, Godzilla card. 
All right, and like I said in a previous video, if you're buying boosters of Ikoria, I mean, I get why you are going to that's how you get your four ofs and stuff, but uh, unless you're looking for rares and you're probably still only going to get one, I, I don't think you should buy booster boxes right now. You should be buying <clears throat> uh, these collector boosters because you get way better value uh, for what you're spending. Yeah, they're a little bit more pricey, I understand that, but uh, at least you kind of get back what you got. I mean, it's pretty much all lost right now. You buy a booster box, Prickly Marmoset, Dismal Backwater, Gloom Pangolin, Penguins. All right. Uh, Flourish, Flourishing Fox. Necropanther. And a Mountain. Here should be our Commander card. Did not get what we wanted. I want that new counter spell. All right. Eon Fro Flicker. Uh, enters the battlefield. If you cast it, target opponent... X or take, I'm so sorry. Target opponent takes an extra turn after this one. Until your next turn... You and Planeswalkers can draw a game for protection from that player. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Uh, and Predictable Cyclones. So we got two tornadoes in a row. This one has no sharks. Ooh, Lutri, the uh, super banned card. Nice. Foil, though. I'll take it. It's pretty good. All right, Glowstone Recluse. Cavern Whisperer. Cub Warden, full art foil, and our... All right, we got Godzilla. No kidding. All right, Primeval Champion, the Uncommon 1111 Trample. Uh, cycle one in a green. When you cycle uh, Titanith Rex, put a Trample Counter uh, on Creature You Control. Nice, and then the foil. Oh, sorry, wrong pile. All right, put that there, put that to the side. All right, so we're halfway through the box already. We got this many packs left. Uh, let's keep going. Alright, Beast Token again. Throw it to the side. Unexpected Fangs. Put a 1 1 counter on And a Lifelink counter on Target Creature. Okay, cool. Uh, Greater Sandworm. Scoured Barons. Thieving Otter. I think this is actually going to see quite a bit of play, too. It's pretty nice. Alright. Uh, Regal Leosaur. Another Mana Rock. 3 for 3. Only it's three for one. All right, and cycle. Planes. All right, first commander card. All right, we got Boneyard Mycodrax. All right, equal the number of other creature cards in your graveyard. All right, got some, some playability, I suppose, for three. All right, uh, Gigantha the Wellspring. First full art. Nice. Labyrinth Venturer. Uh, enters the battlefield, choose odd or even, has protection from each converted mana cost, uh, so if you choose odd, you've got some protection from odd, okay, cool. All right, uh, alternate art, alternate art, ooh, got another octopus, that's our first dubs, all right. And then boom, what do we got here? Godzilla, king of the monsters. So we got two actual Godzillas, nice. Lethal damage dealt the creature you control determined by their power uh, rather than their toughness. Cool. Full art. Like I said, Cloud Piercer. Alright. Here we go. Next pack. Man, we're getting tons of beast tokens. Alright. Aegis Turtle. Savai Sabretooth. Patagia Tiger. Bristling Boar. Avian Oddity. Uh, Sonorous Howlbonder and our forest. So next should be our commander card after this foil forest. And not to my knowledge can you get any of these foil, but uh, let's see here. We got Decoy Gambit. For each of your opponent, you choose up to one target creature that player controls, then return that creature to its owner's hand unless this controller has you draw cards. So you could draw three cards or return three creatures to hands. That's pretty good. Uh, so I think I get some play. Nice. Full art. Uh, Luminous Broodmoth, pretty solid card. Flying whenever a creature you control without flying dies, return it to the battlefield under its owner's control with a flying counter on it. Solid. Alright. Oh, foil Gigantha. Alright, alternate art. Alternate art. Ooh, we got the, the full art mythic one. Broca's Apex of Forever. Nice. And our Godzilla this time, another baby Godzilla. Yeah, I get tons of baby Godzillas. Alright. And then, <laughs> I hate this card, Porky Parrot. All right, we have four packs left. What can we get? 
kept bird. You know, I want to say too, didn't mean to offend people in the last video. Uh, I understand there's some good cards that I have gotten. These have been really good packs. They've been really good for me. That is true. Uh, however, the hunt was for the one uh, convolute. Yes. Um, I was just looking for the one, you know? And uh, I didn't get them in both of the boxes. Well, in uh, the English box. So, anyway, uh, General Enforcer. Let's see here. Jessica Unicorn, or Oricorn, excuse me. Mountain. All right, so Commander card. All right, Netherborn, Netherborn Altar. Put a soul counter on Netherborn Altar, put your commander into the hand from the command zone, then you lose three life for each soul counter on Netherborn Altar. Actually, that's pretty good. Hmm. Yeah, it's cheap. It's a pretty good card. Mythos of Aluna, oh, man, these arts are so nice. All right, Bonders Enclave. Nice, alter, or an alternate full art for it. All right, Volpikeet, Boneyard Lurker, Triome, all right. And this next one's not foil, but we got another Godzilla. Doom Inevitable, nice. All right, throw that in the Godzilla pile. Three more. All right, Dinosaur Beast, Blade Vanish. Counter target spell, Essence Scatter, Survivor's Bond, Spell we uh, Spell Eater Wolverine, Zygoth Crystal, Keen Sight Mentor, Swamp, Paco Arcane Retriever. Ooh, we got a uh, the dog. All right. Uh, let's see, Elemental Hound, partner with Halden, the Arcanist, haste whenever it attacks, exit the top card of, your play of each player's library, put a one or put a fetch counter on each of them. Put a 1-1 one, one counter on Paco for each non-creature card. Excellent. This way. Nice. So we got the mythic. All right, cool. Uh, Slither Wisp. All right. Uh, a Death's Oasis foil this time. Vulpakeet. Necro Panther. Snapdax. We got another one. Another uh, full art mythic. Nice. And then our... Ooh! Big money, boys! Boom! All right. Space Godzilla DC. All right. Foil. Nice. Well, we got it. The hunt is over. We got two in this box, too. Nice. Like I said, I mean, the price of these are going to go down, but uh, we got them. All right. So, all right. Put that to the side. Got a pile of bulk falling down on me. All right. Let's go. Two more packs. Also got some at the end of this. Uh, we're going to try out. Uh, cat starting development coordinated charge frost links man serval stormwild caprador zagath mamba swamp commander card is the hawk cartograph card cartographer's hawk all right flying when cartographer's hawk deals combat damage to a player who controls more lands than you return it to the owner's hand if you do you may search your library for a planes card point on the battlefield tapped tapped and then shuffle your library uh not something i'm going to be playing but uh okay uh whirlwind of thought titan's nest uh, at the beginning of your upkeep look at the top card of your library you may put that card into your graveyard exile a card from graveyard add one colorless mana all right and you can spend it only to cast colored spells without x cool all right necropanther again all right Dreamtail Heron, Sweet Triome, and another Baby Godzilla. Why do I get Baby Godzilla? All right, so Baby Godzilla, and then the foil. All right, one pack left. Here we go. What will be in the last pack? It could honestly be anything. I don't think there's like a... I mean, there's obviously no way to map this, but uh, I'm not really sure how to say. Uh, Almighty Brushwag. Uh, Day Squad Marshal, Keep Safe, Wilt, Charge the Forever Beast, Barrier Breach, Island. Alright, so the commander card we got is... Oh, nice, we got another mythic one. That's pretty solid. Alright, so we got the Akim the Soaring Wind. Alright, whenever uh, it's flying, whenever you create one or more tokens for the first time each turn, create a 1-1 white bird creature token with flying. Alright, so... 
not very good because it's you know for the first time each turn so you don't get like infinite uh one one white bird tokens that would be way better um but yeah nice we got a mythic though so two mythics all right so actually, i think this is our first ultimatum too wow surprising destroy all non-land permanents your opponent's control full art ultimatum nice mythos of snapdecks love those arts but better in full art but i'll take a, uh, a mythos volpakeet cloud piercer Ooh, the full art this is one of my favorite full arts all right the uh, everquill phoenix all right just looks really really nice so yeah and then our godzilla for all right durat we got a ton of reprints in this are not reprints i say reprints but doubles in this one so we got Evercool phoenix and then durat the perfect pet all right and then uh trumpeting gnar okay so pretty good we got two of the of the uh yes i'm not even gonna say it but we got two of them so that's pretty solid uh now i can hang these up and i got two japanese and two english ones uh both foil and non-foil so it completes the collection i can stop opening these no but uh for real uh so nice all right look at this it's already starting to bend see it's already been a week since these have been released and it's already starting to bend uh, so make sure you sleeve up your, your full art foils. If you don't remember the last video, I told you, make sure you sleeve those up. They bend super quickly. All right. So like I was saying, I'm, I'm going to do something different, uh, here. So I've been thinking, uh, I had an extra pack of 2020, not a great set. This one's Japanese even, uh, and I don't even remember all the cards. Uh, yeah. So we're going to play flip it or rip it. All right. Uh, I used to play this with friends all the time. If you don't know what to play while well, you're in for a treat, or if you don't know how to play, um, and then we will see what happens so i don't want to look at these now i know there's probably a land in here or a, a token uh, i'm not gonna look because i don't remember the japanese pack i think it's backwards so i'm gonna look at one and then cheat the game so uh we'll put these on the table all right i don't think i have enough room to place all of these but we'll do this basically pretty quickly oh here's the token let me throw that away all right so and the way we'll do this right is uh well you want to mix them up all right, because obviously if you do it that way you'll know exactly where they're all at all right and you don't want to be cheating all right so what we're gonna do is we're gonna keep one rip one right so and we'll do it all at once so keep one rip pile on the bottom we're gonna keep that one uh, we'll rip that one keep that one rip that one keep that one rip that one keep that one rip that one we're gonna keep rip Keep, rip, keep. All right, so we'll do it one at a time because uh, that way you can see exactly what I'm gaining or losing. So we have our keep pile on top, rip pile on the bottom. So first keep card is going to be a common garbage. All right, now I plan on doing this with the crazier sets. Like I'm going to get some Eternal Masters or something or Masters, anything really, uh, and do that. Obviously, I'm not going to do this like a beta starter pack. All right, but you know, something a little bit more risk in there. Uh, so this is the first keep. Next one goes to the rip. All right, we're not gonna look until after we rip it. Uh, oh, painful! Look at that core. Nice. All right, boom. Also a common. Nice. Ripped. Let's see what we get to keep. Ooh, we get to keep planeswalker. So uncommon one, but all right. Well, lucky us. <laughs> Keeping a planeswalker, I guess. Uh, and then we're gonna rip the next one. Boom. What did we rip? Another uncommon. All right, keep. Oh, we got the rare. Nice. Instant. You know, I really wish I could read all of this. Kiji, Kiji Oku, Kiken. Kata no Kiken. All right. Anyway, uh, yeah. So we got to keep a rare. Obviously, you guys probably don't care about this, so we're gonna keep the rest of these. But just to give you a basic idea of how we're gonna do this, uh, this is how you do this. So, let's see if we can. Man, these cards are thick. It's like ripping a phone book. Boom. All right, so this is what we ripped. All right, got the lands. Nice. All right, so ripped. And then we got to keep all this crap. All right, so what I'm gonna do though, uh, is once I get a little bit more subscribers, the way I'm gonna do this is, uh, this is gonna be the pack that goes out to the subscribers, right? So you leave your comment, likes, uh, all that down in the bottom. And then uh, I'll add you to the list, and I'll get your information, and we'll send these packs out. Uh, this is just an example of this round. Uh, but once I get some more subscribers, we're going to do that. And like I said, it's going to be some bigger packs out there, you know, so you might 
Win big. So, you know, some Eternal Masters got some Mana Crypts. And I don't care. I'll rip it. All right. So, <laughs> so uh, if we rip anything big, uh, yeah, you know, I'll sign it. I'll send it to you. So, uh, anyway, hope you enjoyed that. Uh, should have more boxes coming next week. I got to order everything because I'm stuck right now in my house in Japan. And everything's closed. Uh, but, yeah. And also, I'm going to be doing a... Uh, I plan on doing a... Uh, a review of the card shops around Tokyo. That'll be my next series. Uh, well, I'm gonna say next series, but in between these box openings, that is my plan. Uh, and I'll hopefully be able to get that out soon when I'm not stuck in the house. So, like I said, hope you enjoyed that. We got some pretty good Godzillas, some re dubs Godzillas though for some reason. Babies, Durat, Perfect Pet, uh, lots of doubles. Normally they don't like that. Usually I get like one double. Obviously this is a good double to get. I'm not complaining about that. But three doubles. All right. Um, so, anyways, hope you enjoyed that. Uh, thanks for watching. Comment, subscribe. Uh, see you next video. Peace, YouTube.